everybody. I have some really good news, even though it's been a very, very difficult week and frustrating week. Um, I just finished midterms, so this gives me a chance to um, answer the questions and make videos to the questions that you guys had asked. Um, let me get this right. Blah, 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 939 has a really, really interesting question, and it's gonna, I'm not gonna lie, it's gonna be really awkward to answer, but you asked it, and I said I would answer, so I'm gonna answer it, and I'm gonna give my opinion. And Recovering Potsy asked a question first, so I'm gonna make her video first, and, um go up from there. If anybody else has any video requests to questions that they might want answered, I will make a video response to you, so just message me your question and I will do my best, I can't promise that it will be quick, to answer your question. Um, it's been an interesting week because I've just been so sore and exhausted and I've been studying and studying and studying since 4 a.m. and um, then I get up at 6.30 and then I go and go and go and go and go and, and head to school and everything at school is uphill and I'm in a wheelchair and that's extremely hard on my arms and I'm sore but the awesome thing today was I was taking um, my, one of my research classes, and I really, really need this research class for my research medicine, and it's a research methods. I get IRB certified Wednesday, and I'm so excited, but, um, I have to get a B or higher to pass this class. Anything below that, they drop you automatically. That's how strict this class is. Um, when I took the midterm, I got a 62. And I was completely devastated. And the professor took me aside and she said, I know you know this. I know you know this. And she said, meet me in my office in 30 minutes. So I just, I went to the cafeteria and I just sat there and I was just like, Lord, please work something out. Please, please, please work something out. And 30 minutes later, I went to her office and she said, I'm going to give you an oral exam, 50 questions. You have 30 seconds to answer each one. I answered each one and I got 100%. So, you know, my dreams of becoming a doctor are com coming closer and closer and closer together and doing research medicine and um it's just amazing how God works everything out and you know he he he's powerful and I also want to say to those who have questions um, I get this right, blah, 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 939 has a very interesting question. It's going to be very awkward to answer, but I will answer it, um, because I said I would. And Recovering Potsy had a question first, so I have to answer her question first. But now that midterms are over, I can answer the questions. And if any of you have questions that you want video responses made to, just message me and I uh, will do my best. I can't um, promise that it will be immediate, but I will try. So, you know, just hang in there. There's always something encouraging happening. You count your blessings. I always, you know, I want to say this. Before you have something to complain about, before you let your mouth complain, let a blessing come out of it first and you will start to see your thinking transform you really will 
I want you to think about it, so I'm going to say it again. Before you have a complaint come out of your mouth, say a blessing that's in your life first. Like, today I was really sore, but before I say that, I'm going to say, um, thank God that I have physical therapy helping me progress. Or, you know, uh, I'm so exhausted, but praise God that from my insomnia, I got to spend time with just me and him by myself till 4 a.m. And I can't relate that through YouTube, how precious of a time that is. It's amazing. So I just wanted to say that and um, stay encouraged. You have to stay encouraged. And there's three C's that I want you to remember every single day. When you're having a hard time, it's Christ, courage, and character. When you reach the point in the day and you think you can't do this anymore, when you reach the point in the day and you think this is too hard, or you reach the point in the day and you think this isn't what I expected for my life, I want you to remember the three C's. Christ, courage, and character. Christ, because we can't do it without him. Courage, because he gives us courage to make it through each moment, each day, each week, each month, each breath. Cur character, because Christ gives us amazing character when we follow what he says. And if we have that amazing character, the light that God puts in us will shine out to the world and they'll start recognizing that. So I want you to remember that. The three C's, Christ, courage, and character. Before you complain, say a blessing. That's all I want to say. And have a good night. Bye.